Hi friends, this is Priyanka from Core and Pure Essential Oils and Products Company and today we are going live uh, to talk about the weight management issues and how we can control it, how naturally you can be you know working on that and we have a very special guest here for that who will be talking about all these and guiding us on how to do the things which will be helping us uh, you know controlling our weight along with uh, like you know the food what we need to take and other measures of what we should take so depending upon that i'll be uh, you know uh, inviting dietitian preeti gupta she is uh, from uh, you know uh, she is having experience of uh, around 16 years in this particular field and uh, she has been guiding people on weight management issues and other issues as well and uh, uh, she's from Lady Irwin College Delhi so let's and uh, I'm just waiting she'll be joining now let me see <laughs> Okay, so the, uh, let's wait for her. She'll be joining in a few moments. So by then, uh, I'll be, you know, giving a little brief about, you know, what exactly the issues in weight management people are facing and, you know, how big this particular problem is. So uh, as per WHO, if you see, we have approximately 650 million people who are facing, you know, uh, weight issues and obesity and uh, in adults, so this is a problem and in 2019, uh, you know that uh, there was uh, you know some publication from WHO which uh, says it's not only that the adults are facing this kind of issue but also people like you know the kids are facing this issue and even you know kids less than five year old are facing this kind of issue so uh, that's a major concern and it has uh, you know very uh, it is uh, you know uh, as we are facing problem today like uh, you know corona it is definitely you know uh, something different it is again a vast thing but again if you talk about obesity it is also a major concern which is making us society you know uh, we can uh, many things like you know if you have a weight issue you'll not be able to work properly and you have health issues we will be deteriorating on those things so you know we just took a step where we should be guiding people and uh, you know we should be helping people to manage the weight and uh, be in the healthy lifestyle and healthy society let me see whether she is coming Mm -hmm. Yes. I think some issues, let me just see. Let me... Mm -hmm.
Hello. Hi. Hi, Preeti. How are you? I'm fine, Priyanka. Yeah, most yeah. welcome to this uh, uh, discussion panel. And, uh, you know, uh, everybody is waiting for you and they are, very, uh, you know, uh, looking for, you know, uh, the uh, knowledge what you have, you'll be sharing with them and how they can be benefited from the knowledge of what you are going to share. And uh, that will be definitely a step towards, you know, making our society healthy and uh, and that too naturally. That's the important fact. <laughs> That's absolutely right. true. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So over to Preeti. Uh, so uh, Preeti, let's uh, start and uh, like, you know, how do you want to, you know, guide them and how, how you want to take it further? Yeah. So, uh, as we are taking the topic of, uh, I think so, overweight, obesity. Yes. So today, so first, let's discuss about the causes of obesity. Like, why do we gain weight? So, uh, when we see in a broader picture, so there are many aspects that we uh, that causes our uh, weight to be increased. So, when we have seen that it is because of our unhealth, unhealthy eating pattern. So, when we are consuming more calories. Then we are uh, just uh, we, uh, like uh, consuming and then uh, we are not uh, working out and that's why we are gaining weight or we are taking junk food. The junk food intake is very high or we are taking sweet. So sweets are also a reason that we gain weight easily. And sometimes I've seen that people don't exercise. They eat everything or they eat healthy, but their sedentary lifestyle is a major cause that they don't lose weight. Then there are many other reasons also besides these. So we can say that it can be hormonal issues. So in women like females, we have a hormones issue like sometimes we have periods problems or uh, there is PCOS is there, some hormones that get disturbed. That's why we increase weight. Even that is a reason. Even sleep is a major issue which I have seen that contributes when uh, to the weight gain. If you're not sleeping properly, then weight gain is natural because the hormones which are needed to uh, get you sleep and they are not active enough. So then there uh, other hormones also get disturbed. So major hormone is there is the insulin hormone, which is responsible for the fat reduction. So uh, again, stress is the major reason. So when we talk about the stress, so stress is like uh, the cortisol hormone. We all know that it is released uh, when we are in stress and that disturbs our insulin level. So when insulin level is uh, increased in our blood, so the fat is not at all metabolized. That's why, again, we tend to gain weight quickly. So I have just uh, come across your products also in some of the things like uh, to reduce the stress, to have more sleep, and uh, these issues can be easily resolved. So we want to know about these type of uh, products which you are coming with. So that can also be beneficial for our audience. So you can guide us right. about that. Yes. Uh, uh, so, uh, Preeti, you know, definitely, uh, as you said, you know, the concerns of what we are talking about, definitely, you know, I was just going through an article uh, from WHO and uh, I was just discussing with people as well, you know, before you came here. So uh, the major problem, the majority of, uh, um, uh, you know, the people who are facing this kind of issue is definitely, as you suggested, that, you know, because of the, uh, you know, eating habits and, you know, you know, the sleeping patterns and uh, this kind of inactivity because people are not exercising and it's like you know we always think that yeah uh, you know we should not eat uh, uh, but yes you know the food cravings are there and, and uh, we tend to eat a lot and uh, you know that too the food habit like you know the junk food what we are taking and uh, the sugar as you said and the fat what we are taking and pizzas yes it's yummy That's to eat but yes uh, you know it has its own consequences so those are the things. So yes, we also came up with as we have our endeavor, we thought of, you know, moving towards this direction. So yes, Core and Pure has come up with quite a few products. If you go through research, like there is an essential oil uh, by the name, uh, by the name, you know, grapefruit. So grapefruit, there are many research done on this where uh, if you are taking uh, two drops of it in a glass of water or even you know you are smelling also because essential oil has got the property like whether you are inhaling it or you are consuming it or even you you are using it uh, topically so it will be entering your blood vessel and when something enters your blood vessel definitely it will have its impact on hormones right 
and these are the hormonal changes because you know the kind of food we are, we are taking it is going uh, you know impacting our hormone and those hormones are, as you suggested that insulin you know is the major uh, thing so it, as you know their secretion uh, matters a lot so these things would be controlling those hormones they would be stopping the food cravings and yes this oil helps in uh, you know stopping the food craving and hence the food craving is stopped uh, like you know 70% of our problem is done <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. really yeah the craving is the major reason why when the people tend to eat more food or they tend to eat the junk food or the cravings are there then they uh, tend to binge also on the foods like uh, right. sometimes they eat chips also some chocolates are there so this is controlled by this grapefruit uh, oil so that is a very good thing because grapefruit is a very good uh, uh, fruit which is uh, helpful in your fat reduction but in india when we see that grapefruit is not so easily available and we can buy it so easily so uh, when i've come across this product so this is the product which they have taken the grapefruit from i think so out of india abroad only only you have taken and just extracted that uh, uh, oil from it yes yeah, yeah as so, one uh, basically mm-hmm. grapefruit is not indian fruit it uh, it is yeah. uh, basically uh, basically from america and uh, you know from there you need to it, it be extracted from the rind of uh, the fruit okay. so definitely it is uh, the production is not here in india you know we need to uh, yeah that's there. why so yeah. so you are making that that is a very good thing yes. that people can easily right. include that in the diet then again comes the uh, so steroids are also the reason when people take because of any medicines or anything that they are uh, suffering from so the the medicines are being prescribed so some of the medicines have steroids in them so steroids are a ma- major reason that will increase your bloating also then water retention increases even the fat level also increases if you take it for a longer time of period so then also yes. we have a problem so after that the people have stress so stress is a major reason which is causing us a lot of problem of the weight issues so this is a major thing so i have seen your uh, stress this thing also that you have some oils that can be inhaled or something so that we can reduce our stress Yes, I see. Normally, if you see stress wise, uh, it is any smell. If you are, uh, you know, going for, if you are smelling something, you know, depending upon uh, your taste, also it can be because you know there are some components which are present in uh, those uh, uh, fruits or you know flowers. Uh, for example, if you see yesterday's newspaper. you know there was uh, in in times uh, like you know there was uh, some article from um, like there was a clipping of uh, eli raisana and she is mm. three times gold medalist olympics gold medalist in uh, gymnast okay. she is uh, from usa and uh, what she says is that uh, you know gardening is something which helps me a lot in relaxing and that too when i go to my garden i stop at the fragrance and that fragrance is of life right right so mm. when she goes near you know the plant which is like anything like uh, because it can be lemon grass which has you know lime smell then it can be lemon itself where you can go and stop and these things would be refreshing you and energizing you right so when you are getting this type of a smell definitely it helps you in controlling the things and it it relaxes and when you are ease definitely you know it energizes and you take up your work so uh, food and uh, fragrance and uh, the ambience what you are in these things matters a lot right uh, so uh, definitely you know the food pattern also you know and uh, you would be suggesting you know our, our audience uh, how they can and what they can eat which will be helping in uh, yeah. uh, reducing their stress level so now we have discussed about the causes of the weight gain so now let's see that what can be done to control this weight gain so that we can reduce the weight also and it can be controlled in a healthy manner so first important thing is the healthy foods that has to be taken in our diet mm-hmm. so in the healthy foods some people matlab some diet i have seen that what they include is just a, a fruits diet or eating nothing so that is not at all healthy so you should have everything in your diet it should be fat also like 2 to 3 teaspoon of fat oil that is the extra virgin you can use you can use your ghee sarso ka tel you can use mustard oil so these are good oils that have to be included in your diet then again second important thing is the fruits that has to be included and even the vegetables that have lots of fiber 
so that has to be included again in the whole day schedule and then comes about your carbohydrates some people think that they should leave the carbohydrate they should go off wheat so that is a, again not at all good idea what we should do is that we can include some of the ca complex carbohydrate in our diet complex carbohydrate that means we can have uh, multigrain things multigrain roti we can change the atas in our roti so that it can be more complex and uh, the digestive system is more active for that so then you get uh, get more fiber and uh, then your weight also reduce automatically even the water intake is very necessary when we talk about the uh, reducing the weight so when uh, i've just come across many clients that uh, they say that they don't drink water at all just two glasses or three glasses of water but that is mm -hmm. very essential when we talk about water is very essential for your losing weight water has a component which will throw out your toxins out of your body even it is very good for cleansing your organs so it has to be consumed and even your skin glow and everything comes when we drink water so we can add anything in your water also some people don't want to have the plain water so they can have the uh, like cucumber lemon slices even these thing can be added so that it can be made tasty like your pudina patta that is in the uh, the summers that is being there so you can add these things so the flavors also come so this thing we can do then exercise is very important again exercise okay. when we do so that is a may basic uh, thing that will metabolize like metabolism is increased by doing the exercise so movement is necessary if you don't have time also then also you do just half an hour walk at least that should be there in your daily routine and you should not be keep on sitting like at one place whole day like what happens that people complain that uh, they are just working and they don't get time to walk also so what we can do is when we are talking on phone at least phone call is coming na you can just roam around and talk to them so that will again be a major thing that you can easily do without even thinking because then you are just wasting your you are uh, just uh, doing the energy is being consumed so there way there wise you can do that also now comes the massages when we talk about so massages are also very important so people lose weight but sometimes what happens their skin always gets loose after losing the weight and their blood mm -hmm. circulation is not proper because the right. thing is that blood circulation the uh, pores are not so open so tightening is needed even cellulite jo aapka upar uh, jo fat layer hota that is again has to be melted so these things also be needed so i just suggest my clients who lose 5 to 10 kg that they should go for a massage so that their tightening and uh, cellulite removal uh, fat removal is also there and detoxification is also needed so for yeah. that also i have tried your oils that is very good so you can okay. explain that also to the to our audience to uh, what it is about okay uh, right as you said you know the massage thing yes massage is very important and you know uh, according to your whatever it suggests it is all you know research based thing what we talk about so if you see massage is a very old technique right you know since ages you know people are doing massage and uh, in fact we suggest that you know twice a week you should go for the massage and yeah. all so it tightens your muscle apart from that it also helps because you know they, you are you know you have some points where you have to do the massage and it will be releasing the toxins otherwise yeah. also like any oil if you are using like sarso ka tel you know people were using in uh, uh, old days or even uh, you know til ka tel that is in ayurveda mm -hmm. if you see til ka tel is a very common sesame oil is a very common thing which in any pain oil you know sesame has been used so agar aap usse massage karte ho and you know to those pulse points and you know those points if you have uh, you are massaging it it will be releasing the toxins and when we use essential oils specifically essential oil has got the property that it as i said that it will be entering your blood when any which way you are using it will be entering your blood and there are oils for example if i say juniper berry oil so juniper is something which impacts you know on your kidney it has impact it has impact on your liver so and these are the places where the toxins are accumulated right so when you are massaging it will go inside because it goes inside your blood and anything which is going going inside your blood would be impacting hormone so it will help in clearing those uh, toxins and once the toxin is cleared uh, 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 like you know it's cleared so definitely you know your metabolic system is in place and then when you are doing the massage you definitely your muscles are intact and you know they are tightened so that's how it helps in uh, like you know definitely 
doing that apart from tox uh, like you know detox we also have a cellulite oil which is again you know blend of different essential oils where it uh, like it it has it is combination of two three different you know, things so you know why we put on weight as because of the craving one thing then again you know the metabolic system is not good or the blood circulation is not proper and you know again what happens when you are losing so sometimes what happen you know your skin is loosening at that time so we have cellulite oil also so we suggest like as you have been suggesting to your clients as well like you know uh, five days a week we suggest that you know you can go for the cellulite oil massage and that that can be even self massage five to 10 minutes that is much more than ever because the major part is that you have to make the early blood circulation proper and when you are doing self massage it can be five 10 minutes and it can you can use it like a moisturizer as as well right after bathing or at the time uh, you know when you are going to bed so at night also and these are completely non sticky so it can be used so that's how yeah. we have worked on it and then definitely massage is a very old technique and definitely everybody should go for it yeah. right but that should be like it should be applied in the matlab uh, oil should be applied and it should be stayed on the skin but like people uh, make mistake na they just uh, put the oil the massages and then they go for a bath uh, then it is mm-hmm. I, i don't think so that it will be so effective so for effectiveness yes. i think so they should leave it for at least one hour on the skin ha huh. Yes, forty-five minutes to one hour it should be because you know it takes normally twenty minutes. That uh, essential oil. What happens is uh, particularly essential oil. I'll be talking about that. If you take the massage or you are using it, so after twenty minutes of that, you will have uh, you know uh, if you go for the blood testing, uh, your blood sample would be containing the component of the oil in your. Uh, so definitely, okay. you know, it's twenty uh, minutes takes to reach to the entire body, and then twenty minutes to twenty-five minutes we need to leave it, and then you can go for warm body. That's how it can be. Done. Exactly. Yeah. So that should be understood. Okay. So yes. again, sleep and stress. So you have told us about, and now I I'll just tell you about like how can you reduce the sleep, uh, like uh, sleep issues. So you can have this melatonin uh, level when it decreases in your blood, na. Then also yes. the sleep issues come because this is the main hormone yes. which is re- re- uh, required for your sleep pattern. So what happens? Yes. I've seen that uh, people are on mobile, on the screen all the time. So when in the uh, after dinner and you are you want to sleep but you are just taking your mobile in front of you or you are seeing a movie and after just five minutes you complain that you are you are not getting sleep so it is not possible to have the sleep at that time so you have to at least have a relaxation of half an hour so that is mostly needed so you should switch off all the or this thing because that is hindering your melatonin level to be increased in your Mind. So we, so, we also suggest right, right, mm-hmm. right. We also suggest in our insomnia oil we have, and we do suggest that you know after using you should not watch any screen. Whatever yeah. you have to watch, watch before going to bed, and then you right. can go to bed. Then you know, yeah. so, yes. that is very much necessary. that is very much right, necessary right. and even some of the foods which increase the melatonin level are like your pishta mm-hmm. you can have it in the night so four to five pishta is very good when you want to sleep you get uh, good sleep that is a very good thing okay. then we can have almonds walnuts these nuts and seeds are a excellent source for your uh, sleep issues problem and even you can have milk like uh, in the milk you can add the pishta dry fruits and you can have little ghee with it like one teaspoon of okay. ghee and then you will have a very good sleep even rubbing oil on your uh, uh, this thing feet that is also very very helpful when you want to sleep so these right. things are needed when you uh, want that your sleep should be sound and then you get fresh because whenever the sleep is uh, your uh, sound then your next day is very comfortable even you don't mm-hmm. feel any other problem because of the sleep So yes, that is a yes, basic thing. Yes, yes. That is the basic. Yeah, personally, for me also, it happens. You know, like if I'll be not taking, you know, proper sleep for fifteen, twenty days after that, I feel irritated. So you you need to go for you know proper sleep. So that is definitely there, and that causes a stress level, right? Exactly. So and in fact, you know, I'm going through a research paper also, and it suggested uh, that you know uh, more than uh, you know anything else, these stress and sleep issues are causing you know. Uh, major health concerns yeah, so that, that has to be major. proper that has to be proper and again now comes the stress so i've seen that stress is also a major issue sometimes people yes. sleep they say that uh, our sleeping issue is not a problem but we in the whole day we are fa- facing a lot of stress because of work yes. sometimes because of uh, maybe some other issues like financial issue or something or the other they feel lot of stress because of it now the covid also i've seen that covid ki wajah se bhi people are facing lot of stress because of it 
and after that yes. so we have seen so many problems that people are facing so when we come about stress so stress has to be reduced now ab kehte hain ki stress kaise reduce kare it can't be reduced like uh, just breathing or something but you have to try your pranayam you have to have your long breathing exercises yoga is best mm-hmm. when you talk about uh, stress reduction even some of the okay. foods like your banana is very good then uh, that is good for your dopamine level because these are some of the hormones which in uh, which will reduce your stress level so dopamine is one hormone then another hormone is your uh, serotonin so these has to be properly combined in your diet properly so these has to yes. be taken so like figs you can easily take dry fruits like almonds walnuts these can be consumed in the morning banana can be taken pineapple you can take in the afternoon time because afternoon time the serotonin level is very necessary serotonin is made when we take green tea when we take pineapple so these are the sources even the probiotics are very good for that so you can have chaj like your buttermilk is there even some of the food items are also there like uh, you can have uh, this thing fermented uh, things na like kanji and everything so these things you can easily have so rice kanji okay. gajar kanji these are again good for your uh, relieving the stress but again this has to be done uh, in whole process it can't be done ki aapne sirf banana kha li and then stress is reduced it is not possible you have to have all these steps together then only it can be reduced so we have to work upon right. that for uh, right. maintaining this thing yeah. right right yeah so uh, definitely you know these are the uh, like you know common uh, things you know common ailments because of which and uh, you know the food you have told us so how about because uh, you know we have seen the uh, yeah like weight issues with women mm-hmm. as well right and uh, you know uh, women who are facing pcod problems and those as well so it happens there too so how about, how do you uh, you know guide those people uh, the, uh, like you know those who are facing this kind of issue and the weight issue because of that like hormonal issues when the people are facing like pcod and all that again this is a very this thing approach that it is not a one day process it takes times to heal so if you have like uh, we have done our session before also with dr pooja she is a gynecologist so she also told us that it has to be treated in a uh, uh, like long way pattern it is not like if you are taking medicine just for one month and it is treated so you need to have yes. the regulation of everything like exercise is very necessary again for the pcod thing yes. and again the diet has to be controlled again no refined foods no junk food even your packaged food and processed food has to be reduced kyunki wo sabse zyada aapko problem kar raha hai packaged and processed food because the, what uh, things they have included in the, in them na no? the preservatives that they have so that is a major reason that you increase like bread is a major reason jo bread aap kehte hain ki brown bread we can eat so brown bread is okay if you don't have any other problem because it is having only 30% of your uh, whole wheat otherwise it is 70% or is your maida only so it is not at okay. all so healthy but again if you right. don't have any pcod or any other problem just weight issue then also you can have but pcod may try to avoid it because again this is a problem major problem in the pcod pcod may sugar is also a major problem because what happens is the insulin resistance insulin jo hormone hota that again uh, goes high so it is not uh, reacting properly so that is a, again a problem so pcod mein to they have to the patient has to be the client has to be having a lot of patience in them otherwise now what mm-hmm. happens they think that in one month only they will reduce and uh, they will be fit but it is not possible so it takes like not times possible. because it has been developed for over years now so it will not be able to be vanished in 2 to 3 months it takes times but exactly. you can have gradually you can improve that health and everything mm-hmm. so we can do that yes so pcod also yeah, i think yeah. so you have some oils that we can apply and uh, it can be reduced or something for the pcod uh, see, pcod definitely, yes definitely yes like you know geranium is something which is said to be you know women's uh, best friend and geranium if you are and clarisage you know if you are using those uh, oils and it is just very nominal you can uh, use it in your moisturizer you can use it uh, in uh, um, you know b- uh, body oil you can just add two three drops and you can even rub on your uh, tummy area because uh, you know the uterus is there so it goes directly and it works faster in that case and it uh, impacts on the hormones and uh, definitely it helps in fact you know you uh, if rose water what you are using yeah. if that is 100% pure so rose water also helps in you know uh, taking care of pcod problem 
so okay. that's it so definitely it is all about the lifestyle what we are doing and uh, you know what we are uh, living so we need to control those things and uh, we need to maintain on the lifestyle definitely we have to go back to the basics again <laughs> the natural yeah, again. is the best so diet is yeah. simple diet is not at all a complex yes. thing that you what yeah. is available in home that you can easily have it no problem but the thing is that yes. sometimes a cheat is also okay like when when is one is a once a week you can have easily have your pizza burger anything you want to have but rest of the six mm-hmm. days you should have a maintenance like a proper this healthy pattern of diet na no? so that it can control okay. your cravings also yes. like one day cheat is even given this i i give the people the one day cheat also because what happens then when they have so many cravings na no? they don't are not mm-hmm. able to concentrate on diet So what happens? Yes. The diet is again broken. They are uh, t- uh, trying to binge on chocolates or namkins. Mm. So that is again a b- bad habit. So one day when they want to have, they can have their own choice. One thing. So that will reduce their cravings. Even your oil is there, which reduces the cravings. So they can easily lose weight. So that is not a problem. Yes. Even I have seen the pregnancy, the pro- pregnancy after pregnancy, most of the female gain weight, and that is quite not natural. That is not a problem because uh, after pregnancy, that birth of the baby, the body always changes. The hormones are changed, and uh, the body structure is uh, even changed. So that is not a problem. So if you gain weight, that is very easy to lose also. Pregnancy weight is the right. most easiest weight that you can easily lose because that has been gained in nine months, and you can easily mm-hmm. just reduce that. And again, just minimum, uh, less than nine months, you can easily reduce that weight. So yes, you should yes, not worry yes, about yes, that yes. thing because people worry about yes. it. So, right. yeah. so as per your food and exercise is must that we have to do. It's not that we'll be thinking that exercise nahi karna hai and then ham patle ho jaye. It's not possible. <laughs> Right. Yeah, yes, I don't, yeah, I don't say that do a gymming or something like that. I just say that have mm-hmm. a walk only. If it, if you are not available, and nothing is there. Like in COVID times, we have seen that gyms are closed and people are fearing that they don't want to go to gym. So there is no need also. On in the house only, you can do your mat exercises. You can do your jogging exercise, on spot jogging. Anything can possible if you are willing to do it. So that is a basic mm-hmm. thing. Okay. You should have this thing in your. You can do uh, home. It. Yeah, we can do it. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, so, Priti, so I take, would be. Yeah. Let I, us take I some questions if people have. have. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for yeah. others coming to. If they, if okay. people have some questions, they can write it down, and we can take up the questions, and we can help them out in understanding. You know what they are going to understand and know about. Not a problem. Right. All right. Yeah. So let's so, see if uh, anybody else. Yes, so a uh, pretty just uh, just for my knowledge mm-hmm. sake, uh, as we talk about you know we have spoken about uh, PCOD and we have spoken about stress level and all those. Menopause also has uh, you know some uh, uh, something to do yeah. with this. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Menopause so is the major it. problem where people gain mm-hmm. weight. That is uh, not at all uh, left behind because where, what mm-hmm. happens is your uh, cycle is completely. finished or it is going to be finished again the hormones mm-hmm. are being disturbed so your progesterone okay. level your uh, these levels estrogen levels these are being like shattered so when these are not able to be made inside your body so they are basically controlling your fat level so it is not mm-hmm. being made in the body now and you have mm-hmm. you start gaining weight or your metabolism suddenly slows down a lot Right. So that is yeah, I can see some question from Inner Thoughts. Please tell grapefruit alternative. Okay, so grapefruit alternative is uh, if we go by research, yes, any citrus oil for that matter helps us. If you see, you know, I have seen, uh, you know, people what they suggest. Uh, I, I, I don't know, you know, there are a few people who suggest that uh, take nine lemons and then boil it. Uh, take one glass of water and then boil it to half, and then you can drink for, uh, you know. those uh, detoxification and then you know stuff like that but daily you cannot do it right so any uh, citrus oil for that matter is effective let it be uh, a lemon or let it be orange so that helps in controlling the food craving but yes grapefruit uh, has got number one position in that <laughs> so okay. that is no right yeah Yes, so Suniti. Yeah, I think so. Your question is being answered. So you can have any other uh, this thing, but grapefruit is like a maximum thing. So these are small, small alternatives that you can have, but it will not be so effective if we talk about grapefruit. So citrus fruits can be there. You can have it. 
yeah right yes uh, so that's how it is asteroid you told us you told us hormonal issues and uh, you know stuff like that anything apart from that which you would love to any you know regular food if we have to go for you know which will be helping us in controlling the weight and you know making us active that is I, like sometimes i feel that you know your eating patterns also make you a little lethargy and uh, stuff like that right so on that's that ground would you like to Or tell us something. Or yeah, tell us something. Sometimes, na, because after COVID, I have seen that after COVID, na, people don't want to do exercises. So what happens right. is their body is like weak from inside. They don't want to wake up. Their uh, waking cycle, like uh, waking up cycle, is also being shattered. So they don't want to exercise at all. So that's why they are mm-hmm. gaining weight. So after COVID, on uh, also I am facing that people are gaining weight because they are not doing anything. If they are controlling their diet also. then also it is not so 100% that they were given previously so they don't when they don't want to exercise how can you force them to exercise so that is a basic right. basic issue that they are having it, mm-hmm. this thing because right. stamina is right. lose no because stamina is not there mm-hmm. and when you force them then they don't want to do it because their energy is not again come back because of this Right. So I can suggest them. No, Papa, like your oil, which after smelling they will be energetic and they would want to go for <laughs> the exercises. For okay. example, you know, very common thing. आपने देखा होगा, you know, बोलते हैं ना mentos. Uh, there is a ad mentos. दिमाग की बत्ती जला दे and something like that. So it is because of the peppermint oil, you know, what they use in that. And peppermint has got something inside it, like you know, there's some component of the peppermint oil is like. you know it activates you and uh, you want to really be active on whatever you and it wants to help you in concentrating whatever you are doing so that's how it definitely yes helps yeah. so peppermint oil is something which they can either smell it or they can you know in their green tea they can add a drop of it and have it and it could be helpful now and one more thing yes. i want to add like after covid if yeah. you are not feeling so energetic energetic you can have a multivitamin in your diet because sometimes diet is not giving you proper nutrition diet is necessary okay. but sometimes what happens because of covid na your health is being shattered kyunki health mein jo itni problems aati hain kai bar food se it is not being controlled so you can have some uh, or the other multivitamin which has your iron level your uh, calcium level everything should be there so centrum is very good that i have come across this multivitamin that is very good you can include that after break- breakfast so that will give you mm-hmm. energy and even i have seen one more important thing that hair fall is very common after covid and mm-hmm. now like it is yes. like going crazy so i've seen this right. with many many clients and they are complaining yeah. about it so uh, right. i what i suggest with them is like uh, they can have the iron with the vitamin c again iron mm-hmm. is your beetroot like if you can have beetroot with the amla juice that is a best combination that you can have even sprouts mm-hmm. with the lemon yeah. is a good combination for your uh, hair fall issue but again khali diet say it will not be controlled so you have to have biotin rich foods or biotin Uh, in your tablets like your forty hair, I've just uh, been taking, so that is very good. Or folly mm-hmm. hair, you can take that has the biotin level in it, and even we mm-hmm. need iron and vitamin C. So these three vitamins and zinc and minerals are again needed. So that's why I'm saying mm-hmm. a, a one good where multivitamin is needed. Even your mm-hmm. uh, if you are having uh, just hair issue, you can have this forty hair or uh, biotin tablets. That is again very good. So you have to take mm-hmm. a step out of it. Like nobody will. Uh, come and give you the this thing. You have to take step on your own for reducing your hair. Yes, yes, we can definitely you know guide people, but yes, they will have to do it right. So uh, that's definitely uh, you know we are here to guide. We have uh, you know you on board uh, who is talking about and definitely the guidance is important. But yes, we have to take the steps. And that's right. And now uh, like you know hair fall issue as you uh, mm-hmm. you know start. spoke about it so uh, in this rainy season because of the fungal infection also if you see people who had covid in the month of april you know they had hair fall now right because in normally also it happens now you will see you know the shampoo ad and all will be coming at this point in time only because because of the fungal infection the moisture is there everywhere around right so when moisture is there so uh, because of the fungal infection hair fall starts right so we can add on some uh, let's say you know you can add on argan oil along with lavender and tea tree oil and it yeah. will because these oils are again anti fungal in nature so when you are using those oils that would also help in controlling along with the food what you suggested would be helping us out right that's 100% that's right true. so any other question i think so we are done with it i, I think, think so yes control 
uh, yes uh, something you know dipika goel is saying kindly spell i don't know what uh, she wanted to know if she can write dipika if you are there if you are dipika, listening to us yeah dipika if you can write the full question that you want to ask so that we can answer yes, yes and uh, yeah some syndrome she is uh, i don't know what she yeah. wanted to know so you can mm-hmm. anyways dipika if you are there or like you can write it now or you can again you know message to for and pure or directly to preeti and uh, she would be more than happy to guide you on you know what exactly no, and uh, definitely for and pure can also be you know help you out in understand what you wanted to multivitamin okay multivitamin name is uh, mainly your centrum that i was talking about so centrum is very good if you take it daily and that mm-hmm. comes with the age wise also that i've seen na ki it is like 30 to 40 42 to 55 so this has all the vitamins and minerals in your uh, this thing in the centrum one tablet so one tablet only you have to take after your breakfast so that is very good Mm-hmm. so you can easily so how it. long we should take that multivitamin priti uh, like is like, it for uh, should... 25 days or how is that uh, come again uh, priyanka i could not hear you mm-hmm. like like what i wanted to say about uh, multivitamin do you suggest that 365 days uh, no, um, uh, my that's what i should take almost yeah. okay so we should have at least 20 days like in a in a month when you talk about 20 to 25 mm-hmm. days we should have and 5 days we have to leave so you can just do one thing 5 days in a week you can take and saturday sunday you can just avoid it okay so not a problem so yeah, we can start out centrum centrum spelling she is asking so c e n t r u m centrum simple so i can write it down not a problem so after that you can see mm-hmm. all right I'll just write it down so you can see it. So that you can easily have it. Uh, so I think so. We are done with it. So it was yes, uh, yes. Thanks a lot, Preeti, for coming and uh, you know uh, uh, sparing time for us. And uh, you know, definitely, mm-hmm. I believe you. this uh, uh, would have uh, been benefited from uh, this discussion and uh, definitely okay. in future also we would be glad uh, you know calling you here and getting your inputs on different health issues and uh, thanks a lot once again for coming here and okay. joining thanks us. priyanka your oils are also wonderful i have been using that's why i just recommended my clients also some of them who need it mainly not so that is a thing so whoever needs it they can easily get in contact with you so you can prescribe yes. them thank you Definitely. very much priyanka yes thanks a lot priti thank you thank thanks you everybody for joining thank okay, you bye bye, bye. bye.